Because the thing is, when someone like me hears you ask those questions, the immediate understanding I have is that clearly you don't agree with that and that clearly you think hell isn't forever and that clearly you think people can get out of hell. Now, I'd be interested if you're willing to say that quite clearly because often when people have asked you that, well, you don't say that. You just answer with a question or whatever. Do well, you think people can get out of, 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 of hell and, and go back to heaven? Is that what you're saying? I'm simply beginning with when we use eternal yeah. or forever, is this a category? Are we talking about the same thing that the biblical writers talked of? So like in the Hebrew scriptures, olam is the closest word. And Jonah says that he was in the belly of the fish for olam, which was three days. So I'm just asking when we take our forever and we impose it, and are, are we bringing an assumption to the scripture that the writers don't have? Okay, so that to me, that, that just sounds like universalism and the fact that, that, that hell isn't forever. That's a basic sort of biblical studies yeah. question. And, when Jesus says eternal punishment, what does he mean? And is there sort of a larger context? Because when he says eternal can, life... Can I, can I come, though, moving beyond the Greek to, yeah. to his, if you like, it's, to, to me what comes through in the book more is that it, you don't like the picture that this would paint of God in the first place. And, and so well, a couple, when, when a couple Adrian, of people ask, what, let me just get these questions out. One person asks, is your generous view, they call it, of judgment and reconciliation primarily the product of Bible study or the application of kindly logic, i.e. the idea that God couldn't be like this? And another person asks, <laughs> and this is more directed yeah. at you, Adrian, and your view of hell. If we believe God is justice, how can a finite human being with a finite ability to reason come to earn infinite punishment? Surely justice demands that um, the time fits the crime. How, how on earth can we believe in an eternal conscious torment? I mean, obviously, a lot of people do struggle with this. And you've mentioned already a, another option, Rob, which doesn't really feature in the book, but annihilationism, this idea that people... Yeah, there's, there's a chosen, section on the go, book, a sort of the ex-human, post-human, okay. formerly human. There, that's one of the sort of... There's, that's the way many people... Sure. Um, Are you more comfortable with that than the eternal conscious torment view? I mean, it's, it seems to me like you've definitely ruled that out as being even considered you know that just for you is totally out of kilter with the idea well of it, it just raises questions and so so like when i'm when i'm asking adrian those are legitimate honest straightforward yeah. but tell can me we more get an answer to that. the question from you rob i suppose well, well, wait, 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 what let me back do up. you think is the answer to that question well well do when you... he says like in the questioner who says mm. um a finite being in a finite segment of time receives infinite punishment that has to be sort of kept up and maintained by God, that says something about the nature of God. Hmm. So let's say a 17-year-old rejects Christ, dies, and 17 million years from now, however you want to say that, that's obviously a sort of over-the-top language, God is still punishing that person. Is God like that? And I think it's a totally legitimate Do you think question. God is like that, Rob? No, I don't okay. think God is like that. Okay, so so I, I'm taking from that answer that you you definitely do not believe in eternal conscious torment. I mean, I, I can't draw any other conclusion that that you well, don't believe in that, and that's <laughs> fine. That's fine. But there's lots of evangelicals who would agree with you. Is that a possibility? Hang on a minute. Is that is that a possibility? Look, there are is plenty that, of it is. There, is that a possibility? Well, yes. Of course. Well, so but, if your question is is do is that a possibility? Yeah, it is.